All right, so you're in pre me and you want to edit, update your profile and make sure that all of your contact information is correct. You can upload your picture, etc. To do that, click on the little business card down here in the lower left, or if this menu is expanded, click on My Profile. That's going to drop you into the area where you can edit pretty much everything about yourself and what your clients see that's not brand related. Okay, branding is, is done separately in your settings, but if it's tied to you, to your NMLS number, to your address, all of that can be edited here. So you can see here, we've got our primary contact information, including the ability to add a website if you want that to be inside of your, um, you know, any of your contact information or the email signatures. Um, here's our loan officer link. You can add or select which loan application version you're gonna pick. We have short, long, and smart, or you can select custom. By default, you're gonna have the smart 1003. It's our best option. And then you can also add a signature. Now this signature is gonna show up on your pre-approval letters. If you've got the dynamic text field built into your letter template. You're, the rest of this is really straightforward, guys. What's your address? Do you want a bio to show up? Here's my profile image. This is just a list of your loans. What social media links do you want to make available to your clients and real estate partners to see? Are you using Zapier, for example, and need to generate an API key so you can integrate with the CRM or any other sort of system that you want pre-approved me to talk to? And then what are outside the box or out of the box, I should say, integrations? That's going to be our Dropbox, DocuSign, Encompass, Landing Pad, Point, Zapier. This is where you initiate those integrations. Now, there are videos that are separate to show you how to do this part, but this is where you're going to find them. It's inside your profile. So hopefully that helps you understand uh, your profile and exactly what you can do in it. The other thing is you can also send yourself an app download if you want to send yourself the mobile app if you don't have it on your phone already. Hopefully that helps you guys, and we'll look forward to chatting with you in the next video.